This biotech breakthrough doesn't work exactly like a typical mask. Let's go through it step by step to make sure you're getting the best K-18 experience. First, you're gonna get into the shower. You're gonna shampoo as usual, but skip the conditioner. I know this sounds scary, but K-18 needs a clean canvas to fully penetrate into the innermost layers of the hair. Once you've shampooed and hopped out of the shower, make sure to towel dry your hair until damp. Overly wet hair makes it harder for the peptide to penetrate. Now the fun part, you're ready to apply your K-18. We know everyone's hair is different and we don't wanna tell you how to live your life. On the lowest end, people use about half a pump. On the highest end, no more than three. On average, people use about two pumps. That's it, that's all you need. If you're using the smaller K-18 size, triple those numbers. It's best to start with one pump and add more as needed. Then work evenly into the hair from ends to roots and let sit four minutes to activate. And P.S. It's a leave-in, so leave it in. No rinse needed. Once those four minutes are up, you can comb and style as usual. Your hair will be much easier to comb through after the peptide has had a chance to penetrate. After the four minutes, you can pretty much do whatever you want. You can add an additional product like a leave-in or a heat protectant and get to styling. We recommend using K18 for four to six washes, and then you can switch to maintenance mode and use as needed. And just remember, damage is ongoing, so use of K18 should be too.